Unit Eight. Choose love. Read about it. Imagine a store which a bunch of people enter to do some shopping, but they all leave it with their hands empty. You may doubt what they are doing, but they are actually doing something meaningful here. Choose Love is an extraordinary store of its kind. Unlike many stores where people can shop for themselves, this store allows buyers to buy real gifts for underprivileged refugees. Choose Love, a pop-up store, opens on an irregular basis in London and New York. The store is run by Help Refugees, a United Kingdom-based charity that tries to improve the lives of refugees. Shop your heart out, leave with nothing, and feel the love is the slogan of the store. It is one of the most active organizations that work on the serious refugee crisis in Europe. The store started with the help of enthusiastic volunteers, and it has become a model for organizations that want to help refugees. Thanks to the Choose Love store, people, by making purchases, are able to convey their love and genuine concern to refugees who are in need of help. The aim of such stores is to urge buyers to think through how to satisfy the demands of less fortunate people instead of simply those of their own. The items featured in the Choose Love store demonstrate the different needs refugees have. Leaving their countries, refugees who suffered from persecution dreamed of a new home. When they arrived at Europe's borders, they might have been desperate for day-to-day -day survival, could have sought immediate shelter, and must have hunted for food, clothing, blankets, and sleeping bags. These will protect them from the chill at night and make their living conditions in refugee camps more comfortable. But their needs don't end there; they require other necessities for everyday life. Therefore, the store also provides products such as lamps and meal ingredients to cater to these refugees after they leave the camps. And find a place to settle in the cities. Finally, the Choose Love store has provided the future that these refugees deserve. Aside from legal services and medical care, the store offers products to them to adapt to their new countries. Dictionaries, computer equipment, and school bags are displayed in the store. These are for the refugees who have started learning the local languages. This store has allowed people to better understand what a refugee's life is like, and it has also passed a positive message on to the public. Although the customers can shop for themselves, they choose to offer a friendly gesture. As the number of refugees is still on the increase, no one should overlook the problem. Fortunately, these charitable organizations have been making efforts to raise awareness of the refugee crisis. Hopefully, with such aid, these people who are forced to abandon their countries can feel at home in the new land.